So this week we are actually going into a little bit more of the advanced functions of Microsoft Excel. One of the things we have to think about with these functions is every single one of them is expecting a parameter. Now let's take for example uh, the EVG uh, educational video game uh, company. One of the things that we want to see is, is this the person's birth month? Now if we cheat and we scroll all the way over here, you can see that we've actually got birthdays this month. We're actually just cheating and saying, oh, if their birthday is in September. So we got to remember that, AD1. So we do that by looking at the birth year. But first things first, uh, birthday month. One of the things you notice is as I finish typing out that, uh, Excel luckily uh, sort of understands that I'm going to be going through a, the same kind of formatting process so it just went ahead and applied it to there. So now we have to go in and we have to put in that uh, kind of question. Is this month or were they born this month? So you know we're going to buy them a sheet cake or something like that. Well, we can see, for example, uh, you know, low, for example, uh, yeah, we would uh, say yes for her. But Forbes, on the other hand, we would not because, again, uh, low, birth month, nine, Forbes, 12. So how do we do that? Well, we're revisiting the idea of what is known as the if statement. The if statement, uh, if you click on the insert a function, it'll be the first thing that hopefully pops up. If not, going down and selecting logical will sort of reduce everything down to sort of the logical uh, formulas. Case in point, if. Now again, how an if statement works is it breaks down into three sections. The logical test, the value if it's true, in the value if it's false. So our logical test, we're saying, does their birthday begin with a nine, basically? One of the ways we can do that is through a new function called month. Mm -hmm. Now as soon as I put in month at birth date, what I'm saying is all of a sudden, pull out the date of whatever's being typed. Pull out the month that's being uh, kind of addressed in that that time, that date time, and then let's see if it equals dollar sign ad dollar sign one. If that's true, if this is true, if they are born in September, present a yes. However, if they are not, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to cheat and I'm going to go ahead and just put in two quotes here. That way, again, I don't see anything. And as soon as I hit OK, you see all of a sudden, you know, low birthday, uh, sped, sp spaduda, him, uh, Johnson, Johnson. These are, all of those names are now being established.